And today I am going to be reviewing Chloe Ting's. I've gotten several requests to review Chloe Ting. Today it's a roast of Chloe Ting. If you're watching this, you were either thinking about doing Chloe Ting's or you have done Chloe Ting's workout oh, or. Okay. Okay, let's, let's have a quick little conversation. Hey, right, what's going on, everyone? So, um, the main reason why I'm making this video. It's because since I've been doing follow along workouts, I've been receiving a lot of comments underneath my posts, a lot of DMs as well, of people kind of asking me about Chloe Ting. What do you think about Chloe Ting? Do you think your workouts are harder than Chloe Ting's? Can you actually get results with Chloe Ting? Now, let me just say this straight away and don't ever get this twisted. I'm not licking no one's ass. I've built my platform over the past five years and I have an amazing subscriber base. If you're watching, you're subscribed, you are one of them. Amazing subscriber base. So don't even think I'm trying to lick anyone's ass. But I've been on YouTube and I've been scrolling down and I've been checking out Chloe Ting. I've been checking out her workouts and I've been checking out what other YouTubers have had to say about Chloe Ting. I'ma keep it so real with every single one of you, but I know a lot of those YouTubers are just hating. And the main reason why I'm making this video is because some of my videos can, you can see the similarity between Chloe Ting's and my videos. You can see the titles, you can see 30 days get abs or whatever the case may be. Now I'm seeing a lot of other YouTubers saying, you can't get abs in two weeks. Why is she lying to everyone? Let me just, let me just say this. For one, everyone is different. Everyone is in different parts of their weight loss journey. There are certain people that are holding on to a lot more body fat than others. So if you're going to do Chloe Ting's workout, if you're going to do my workout and you already have a low body fat percentage and you are killing it in the gym, doing your cardio, eating correctly, being in a caloric deficit, then you will see abs. But there are other people that won't get the same transformation they won't get the same results actually you know what there's a lot of youtubers saying that her exercises her workouts are not that intense if you want me to do a follow along workout where i am following her workout i want you to smash the thumbs up button if we get 10k thumbs up i will uh, i will do her video i will do her workout and i'll be completely honest and let you know what i think about her workout so smash the thumbs up button now personally what i think about chloe ting is she has built an amazing platform. I understand who her audience is. I understand who she is talking to. She is not talking to a professional like myself that's trying to, maybe I've put on a bit of weight and trying to get abs. She is talking to that person that has never been to the gym. They have never worked out before. And they just need that boost. They just need that information, that, that starter to get them started. And Chloe Ting is that person. And also, I'm that person as well. So when people are kind of taking shots at Chloe Ting and I'm seeing the videos and they're reviewing her exercises and there's a lot of shade going on, somewhat I kind of feel attacked as well because my exercises, my videos, they are a little bit more intense than Chloe Ting's, but it's the same sort of formula. I'm doing a follow along workout. I'm showing you the best exercises to really target your lower abs, your upper abs. But I also let everybody know that abs are built in the kitchen. It comes down to your diet, it comes down to you doing cardio. And I also know that Chloe Ting says that in her videos as well. But I feel like a lot of people see the views. They see that one of her videos got 200 plus million views. And they're just thinking to themselves, how? It's just basic exercises. How, 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 how is she doing that? There's a lot of hating going on in YouTube. I'm not really the type to kind of jump in here and make sit down videos like this. Because I know that there's a lot of YouTubers, if they were in the same position as Chloe Ting, they would have no problem whatsoever. Yes, her titles are a little bit misleading. Yes, it is clickbaity. That is YouTube. That's YouTube. I clickbait all of my videos and I can say that with my hands up, but this is the thing. If I clickbait you in clicking onto one of my videos, if she clickbaits you into clicking onto one of her videos, when you click, we make sure that we are giving value. We make sure that you are learning. We make sure that we are giving you a killer workout. So yes, it is a bit clickbaity. All YouTubers do it, yeah? Let's not get this twisted. So when it says get abs in two weeks, 
majority of people won't get abs in two weeks but if you are consistent i'm sure she talks about having a good diet doing your cardio making sure you're in a caloric deficit i'm sure it's not you will get abs just by doing these exercises in two weeks and that's it i know there's more to it i haven't really studied her channel like that but i have seen a few videos and i have seen that she has mentioned that you have to do your cardio Everybody is different. Everybody is in a different place with their weight loss journey. So please, any other YouTubers that are thinking about making videos and putting other people down or making videos maybe to kind of get views on their thing, let's not get this twisted. Like there are people out here like Chloe Ting, myself, there's other YouTubers as well that are creating content like this to help other people around the world that haven't been to the gym. They might be a little bit lazy. They might not have the motivation. Our job is to get them up and started and moving. And I can see that's exactly what she's doing, yeah? So I wasn't really gonna make this video, but a lot of people have been asking, what do you think of Chloe Ting? And this, that's, that's what I honestly think, yeah? It Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think. Uh, share this video with all your friends and that's about it, man. I'm not here to promote anything. I just wanted to just share my thoughts. Yeah, that's it. Peace.